Taurus. Let's do Taurus reading for the month of um, March 2023. Taurus. Taurus reading for the month of March. It's already your season, I think, right? No, 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 it's not. <laughs> it is not. I think we are getting into Aries season soon. So, Taurus reading. Taurus reading. I don't know why I'm having a bad feeling before starting to spread the deck. Page of Cups, Seven of Pentacles, Six of Wands. Strength card, King of Swords, Three of Pentacles, Justice, Hierophant. It's a good reading. Don't worry. Moon card, the fool, page of wands. Can I keep going or stop? Victory card, five of wands. Sorry, five of swords. Um, Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. You are hard at work. You're working very hard. You're focused on work and nothing is going to distract you. You're not letting anything take your attention away. Nothing. You're working really hard. Really, really hard. Emotionally, you feel empty. And maybe you're even alone. And um, it's also sad that you feel there's almost nothing you can do about it. You don't see a remedy to it. Um... But there's a, there could be a young um, water sign that has caught your attention. Um, however, there's not much you're going to do about it. I don't see you pursuing it or doing anything about it besides just focusing on work purely. And um, there's something you're going to achieve. Uh, when we say a short-term goal, you're going to achieve that. And um, remember when I said emotionally, you feel empty and alone and, and sad. Um, you have feelings. You have feelings that you'd like to ex express romantically, but... You do not have a, a connection or a, an interest or somebody to help you with that. So you found a way to transmute that energy into work. So you you're not you're not dwelling so much into your love or what exploring your your love life could bring. You're really just into work and um, are very strict about it. Nothing is going to deter you and nothing is going to take you away from that. You want to be very stable. You want to get more wealth. So you are desiring a lot of stability. And um, you're also very spiritual in this point in time. You're working and praying. Let me say that. You're trusting your higher being to bless the work of your hands. To bless you even more. You have a little bit of uh, something bothering you here. I feel like uh, it's what to do with your romantic feelings. Because you're f so focused on work and you want to achieve something and you will achieve something and you will be recognized for your hard work. It's going to happen. And people around you will notice that you do a good work, a good job and they'll commend you for it and... You may even get something good out of it. But there's a, there's a little bit of a nudging in terms of your 
romantic life or um and uh it's a little bit uh it's a an area that you find yourself very vulnerable and um you don't know what to do about it typically when it comes to work your master and you know what to do and but when it comes to that you have no idea how to handle it you may even make poor choices or something like that because it's not your wheelhouse it's not something you've taken time to understand or even care for but your work is going to be really great you're going to achieve uh, going to achieve quite a few things not um not one thing not two but you're going to achieve uh, more than more than one let me say two three four you're going to achieve a lot of things in terms of work and uh, your spirit is also guiding you and rewarding you for your hard work and also you will be investing in some in some new opportunities if you come across them um yes it's um you're working hard and uh it's your month to achieve all the things that uh you've been working hard for that's your reading